morning, everybody. This is NCP. <clears throat> Today, we're going to be getting rid of snakes with Tylenol. Now, it's really the wrong time of year, but I'm going to do it anyway because these have gone bad. These here expired. Well, they're best by January 28th. Today is, um, uh, let's see, was it March? Wednesday the 4th. Yeah, March 4th. Today's March 4th, which you can't see, but whatever. Now, it's March 4th. Uh, we're going to go ahead and inject 80 milligrams or better in these eggs. Um, I got a 20 gauge needle. I don't know why I have 20 gauge needles, but I got a 20 gauge needle. Hopefully that won't crack the shell too bad. If it does, we'll put some wax or something over it. But Ideally, I'd like to get some quail eggs or something, but I'm not going to make a special trip for the wrong time of year. I need to be big. Now, one of my notes, which I can't even read. Uh, they did this in Guam to get rid of the uh, the brown tree snakes. They put it between uh, two pieces of um, like cardboard and uh, paper streamers. And when they dropped them out of the planes, it would get the the cardboard would open up, and the mouse would dangle, and you get caught up in the trees or the canopy. <coughs> so that's how they would <coughs> excuse me. That's how they would take care of that, and it, it would dangle the bait up in the trees. I'm looking here to get water moccasins and. All those type of snakes on the ground level, because that's where I'm at, is the ground level. Um, you need 80 milligrams, or at least one quarter of a standard pill. They put them on mice. I'm going to put it in eggs. I don't know if that'll work or not, but let's try it. Um, and the way I'll test it, the egg is gone, something ate it. Now, let me, I'll get into, I know what you're thinking about hurting other animals, so I'll get into that in a second. Um, you need a quarter of a pill, 80 milligrams. Or so of a quarter pill. I'm using liquid because I'm injecting. I'm not using mice. Uh, dead mice. Um, uh, doo -doo -doo. Basically, for a standard size animal like a dog, something that size, they'd have they'd have to have 500 of the the baits. So, 500 times or 500 of the actual eggs or mice or pills or whatever to kill an actual uh, with if you're using 80 milligrams to kill a similar sized animal. So. There's really not enough here to kill an animal even if it eats it all. It wouldn't kill a, a dog or a cat or anything, which I don't think cats eat eggs anyway. Um, it won't affect birds. Um, snakes are uniquely susceptible to this. Um, I keep saying um a lot because I'm looking at my notes. Um, it's all for time. Um, uh, they lack the enzyme to metabolize acetaminophen. Uh, for a few days, um, Elevated levels of acetaminophen can kill liver cells. In a few hours, it converts the hemoglobin to methoglobin, which has no oxygen transport. It can't carry oxygen in the body, and they die. Now, I'll put a link to the study below, or the, the, the actual results to the, the test over in Guam. And uh, basically, the snake just got tired. They went to sleep in the control groups. Um, they didn't gasp for air. They didn't suffer. It was very humane. And humane's always good if you're given that option, but I want the snakes gone. Um, now, I don't know where I'm going to get smaller eggs, other than quail eggs, for the little tiny snakes. I'm not sure what to do about them yet, but I'll figure it out something. But for right now, we're going to do this. Um, there's, uh, how many eggs we got here? Oh, we got nine eggs, so we're going we're gonna to fix up nine of these things and dope them up. And see how it goes. Just gonna take some Tylenol, children's, because it was the only liquid they had, and um, it doesn't have a lot of additives in it like the adult stuff does. So let me go work up the dose here, and I'll be right back. All right. So I was looking at this, and it's a uh, 160 milligrams for five milliliters. That's the whole thing. Is 160. So I'd need that much. Well, yeah, about that much right there. That's a whole lot of liquid. So, uh, yeah. That's, that's probably going to pop my egg. So, let me make up a uh, super solution. I'll crush up a bunch of pills. I'll put them in a liquid. And, um, yeah. That ain't, that ain't gonna work either. Um, I don't want to do that. Because I don't want an uncontrollable dose for other animals. Let me think. Alright, I got a man to draw it up in this uh, syringe. It's some really thick goo. 
Um, I don't know. Let's see. I went in there earlier and pumped in the amount of air. Nothing happened. So let's see what happens here. Yeah, fluid lock. Yeah, I'm getting fluid lock right there. So I'm only able to get in just a few milligrams. Not enough. So, we're going to have to figure something else out. <clears throat> or get some other egg yolk out of there. Or the egg out of there, but I'm not sure how to do that. That's a thin, thin needle, it's 20 gauge. That's not really good for drawing up thick uh, solutions. As it is. Alright, so let me, uh, let me figure something out. I'll be back. Alright, I got most of it in. Uh, the syringe kind of locks up if you push too quick. And then I had to go back and pull the air out several times. Um, so you can't be done. You just gotta get it all out. That one's full. Oops. That one's full. So now we got that done. Let me go ahead and get the other ones popped and um, pre suck out the air, I guess. And then poke the yolk, yolk sack, I guess. Alright, I'll be right back when I get these set up. I'll be back. Alright, so that was an incredible and huge pain in the butt. I had to refill this several times. Just pain. Pain in the butt. It's really too thick. Uh, I couldn't aspirate hardly any of the yolk out. Some, some came out. <clears throat> I'm guessing that's because they're expired. I don't smell anything, but uh, I'll just put these out in the garden around the river down there and see if they disappear. I doubt they will. It's late in the season. I've only seen uh, I've seen evidence of three snakes, and I saw one snake leaving the area when I was over there. So. I don't know if this will work. I believe it will. It'd be better to have a more potent source of Tylenol and, um, you know, like a pill. If I could put a pill inside there. I don't know, maybe I can, next video, maybe I can open up a pill and drop a, a tablet inside there. This, this is just, just way too thick. It just doesn't work. But, you know, that's how the video works. How the channel works. Um, our, our successes and failures. I'll report back in a week if the eggs are gone, I'll consider it something ate it. If I start finding dead snakes, I'll consider it good. But it'll be totally painless for them. And um, there'll be no fangs in me or my pets. Or my pet, I guess. But I guess, like I said, unique snakes are uniquely susceptible to this. So it shouldn't hurt anything else. Not that anything else is around here, but still. It's not enough here do it so that's it that's the video for today uh, I got a lot of stuff I have to vacuum pack and such and uh, I'll do some commentary maybe tomorrow or something we'll see um, I gotta get stuff rocking here um, I hope you all voted and uh, that's it for today it's North Camp Prepper have a great day everybody NCP out